Okay, it's been about 20 to 25 minutes I've been flying down the coast, San Francisco way the heck back there. So I am coming up on now Santa Cruz, which is going to be right in this area. And then this is going to be Monterey Bay. And it looks really interesting with the Google Earth map, of course. And I think out here is going to be Carmel by Carmel by the Sea and all that stuff. Uh, and East Rooms place. So, yeah, this is Santa Cruz area here. So yeah, interesting place. Certainly, we got this huge big bay, which is an Monterey Bay, I guess. And then we'll just kind of keep on going down. I'm not going to go over there. It's just. Uh, Nah, I don't think that one. I think I'm going to just kind of keep flying straight here. Mm -hmm. Actually, I need to start turning a little bit to the right because I can see the coastline's going to continue on. So. Anyway, that's where we're at right now. Okay, we are just passing Monterey Bay area. Pretty cool. And now, coming upon uh, Carmel by the Sea. Carmel by the Sea. And that should be it right down there to the right. Right in that area there. So we're just cruising down the coast to California. We don't have very far to go before we'll be to the LA area for sure. Still got quite a ways. In fact, everything up here now, this is going to be Big Sur for quite a while, I think. And yeah, we're going to be flying through the Big Sur area. And it's going to take some time, I think. It's pretty, that's a pretty large area. Okay, I am definitely having trouble trying to follow along with the uh, Google Earth map. I now am flying over this airport, so I think either this bay or the next one is going to be San Luis Obispo and Pismo Beach. I'm not, not real sure. I think San Luis Obispo might be here, and then the next one will be uh, the next... Uh, I forget what I'm doing here. Um, yeah, the next. I don't know. It's hard to tell. I'm really having trouble. Uh, <laughs> but uh, anyway, we're getting pretty darn close to the Los Angeles, San the Santa Barbara area. Okay, I, I am pretty fouled up as far as where I think I'm at. This. I've been sitting here on Toggle Pause for a while, <laughs> trying to figure out where the heck this is. This is Morro Bay, right here. Now, we got to go around this big thing, and this bay here is going to be Pismo Beach and San Luis Obispo over here. So yeah, I'm uh, I'm pretty I'm, I'm pretty lost here. But we got her now. I just thought I was I was a lot farther ahead. Than I thought it was, so we'll go ahead and get this thing started. Get off toggle pause and continue flying. We're just gonna fly straight over that inland and then we'll be at Pismo Beach. Okay, we're finally here to the Pismo Beach and um, <clears throat> uh, San Luis Obispo area. I just cut the engine so I can go down because I'm pretty high in elevation, almost 7,000 feet. Anyway, so let's look at where we've been here. We just cut across that. This is really quite beautiful. I'm glad that the online, I got this thing back online. I, so much of the early part of these videos when I was going over the volcanoes were offline and it was horrible. Not, not very nice, but anyway, let's go ahead and zoom in here. So there's really not, not much to see. It's just a really beautiful area. So now, looking off in the distance, 
I'm going to have to go around this. But I'm going to go over this area here in the distance because I believe that's going to be Vandenberg Air Force Base. And I want to fly over that. That's going to be interesting. So I believe that's going to be this area right in there. So we need to straighten ourselves out and we'll start to turn. I don't want to... I don't want to lose too much elevation. I don't want to get kind of headed for that before I restart the engine. So yeah, we're not going to be too awful far from LA now. Well, it definitely, uh, the controls are definitely more sluggish when the engine's uh, not running, basically. But it's time to get that thing running here so we don't lose too much because it'll take a while. I'll still drop in elevation probably a thousand feet before things start to pick up. And as I say that, it's slow, the drop slows down dramatically. As you can see, <laughs> I, need to, I need to drop down even farther. So anyway. We'll let this run a couple of minutes like this without the engine running and try to get that elevation down. All right, we just passed 4,000 feet and we're dropping fast. So let's power back up and see what we can do. That's where we've been. And that's Japan way out there and Hawaii. <laughs> Anyway, yeah, see, we're gonna this time we're gonna drop probably below 3,000 feet. I powered back up at right about 4,000, and see, it's it's strong. It's starting to slow down now, but you lose. I find most of the time you just lose like a thousand feet or more, it's probably gonna be 1,500 feet. So, in that case, you got to be careful. Uh, you know, that's just something I've learned here. You got to be careful not to, you know, to power up before you really need to do it. Anyway, so hopefully we'll start stop around 2,500. Maybe it's going to go a little lower than that. But it would be okay, except uh, you know, flying just above the water. But I'm going to be going a little bit over land here. Anyway, when we get to Vandenberg, we'll bring it back. So, well, let's watch and see what the elevation does here. Is it going to stop at 2,000 feet now? That's what I'm wondering. It ought to. Incorrect heading indicator. I just don't think so. I, I don't know. I, I don't set it, so I don't know how to set it. So it probably is. It probably is, I guess. Oh, it looks like we're going to stop at around 2,200 feet and then we'll start going back up in elevation is my hopes and dreams. So we got to get over this little mountain here. So hopefully Santa Maria. I can't read what else that says. Oh, it's a field, Hancock Field. Alan Hancock Field. Okay, we are going to start climbing again, I hope. Yep, we're going to slowly start climbing again, so i got to keep an eye on that. Because that little bit of hilly area should be above 2,000 feet, but we'll have to... We'll have to keep an eye on that, it's approaching fast.